All right, welcome back. So today I'm not in the shop, but I am out in the field. And I want to show you guys something on the CAT 740. Um, they seem to have a, a problem with the frame cracking. Uh, I did find on the CAT SysWeb, they have an article about all the different ways that these frames will crack. I'll show you the crack on this one in a minute. It's already been repaired. But we've had a couple of them now crack across the bottom of the frame here, you know, crack up the side. And the first one we had actually split in half. I, I'll post pictures on here. Um, this one here cracked along the top, and it, it cracks right along the seam. And you can see that our uh, welder already got to it this morning. Now, if you look at the pictures here, um, this first picture here, this is from the CAT website, from SysWeb. Uh, this is, these are actual pictures that they have uh, here showing how it can crack at the bottom and work its way up, you know, up vertically up the sides of the frame rail. And then this next picture here, this is some actual pictures of one of mine that cracked uh, both sides and the frame actually broke. And it, um, the operator, we had a pretty, well, it's a bare rental. They had a pretty bad operator and he was going down the hall road with this thing pointed up at a, I don't know, about a 30 degree angle and they had to stop the guy. Uh, fortunately, the machine can't rip itself apart or can't fall apart in two pieces because the hoist rams and the drive shaft and everything hold it together. So we basically just had to jack the frame back up, um, you know, so we, that it would go back into place. Uh, uh, my welder Les cut um, big windows in the outside of the frame on both sides, uh, welded up the, uh, you know, cut out, welded up the cracks. And he plated the inside and, you know, with, with like three inch plug welds, you know, with uh, I think he used five eighths plate on the inside. And then he, you know, filled the windows in with some new plate as well. So we, we actually beefed them up from the inside instead of having uh, plates on the outside. So on the CAT SIS website, if you go to REHS 8713-01, you can see they show types of cracking that you can uh, get on the frames here. And if you look at this graphic here from the special instruction, this is how uh, this machine here that I'm doing this video on, this is how it cracked. This is where the two frame rails are butted up against each other and, and welded along the seam. Um, so we just had to cut it out and uh, weld it back up. Um, I've seen some other trucks where guys have taken off this garbage and they, they plate this right here. You know, just to reinforce the frame here because it comes off of this gusset here. And this gusset should have been extended all the way to this gusset. And then the frame would have been fine. But this is just a weak point on these CAT 740s. I think they just hauled too much weight for how they designed this frame. So that's just something I wanted to show you guys. Um, just kind of a flaw that CAT has. And instead of CAT actually coming up with a fix for it, they just came out with a uh, CAT mag, uh, what do they call that? A, a service magazine article. Or, or maybe it was a special instruction I think that they came out with just telling you, hey, keep an eye on these because they can crack. So anyways, thanks for watching. Um, if you haven't subscribed already, please do. And uh, hit the like button. And thanks for watching and have a good day.